Your News 10 Night Watch. Students across the Wabash Valley will soon be heading back to school, and children in Duggar are no different, except they won't be heading to the classroom. That's because the new school still doesn't have a building, except in cyberspace. But school officials say that won't stop them. News 10's Hunter Petroviak has the story. Duggar students won't be hitting the books this school year. Instead, they'll be surfing the web. Union Duggar High School closed its doors at the end of this past school year, leaving parents questioning where they're going to send their kids. This community has fought very hard to keep a local school community here. Indiana Cyber Charter School has stepped in and opened an online charter school in the area. The charter school wants to have a hybrid style learning environment for students. That means learning from online resources and from a teacher in a classroom. A big issue for school officials right now is getting a building. They want to take over the building that just closed in May. At this point we're excited because the uh, school district has and the Department of Education have said that they will do everything they can to expedite all the processes. While school officials are closer to taking over the building, they're starting to hire teachers. A question that was answered Sunday was, who's paying for all of this? Indiana Cyber Charter School is of course a public charter school, so taxpayer dollars uh, go to cover uh, all of the expenses and uh, it's just like any other public school around, we just do it in a different way. School officials are hopeful they'll have kids in the literal classroom on the first day of school, so hopefully they've already started training those teachers. In Duggar with photojournalist David Essex, Hunter Petroviak, News 10. The charter school starts its session on August 25th.